So what I'm going to do today is demonstrate uh, robot localization. So this robot is going to scan the room for visual landmarks that it recognizes. In this case, it's going to be uh, the word beta written on that wall and the word uh, alpha written on another wall. Um, she's going, from this information, she'll be able to determine what room that she's in inside this house and where she is... Uh, where she is within this room um, down to from anywhere from 2 to 10 inches accuracy usually. Um, also once she knows that then she will also know uh, bearings to various other landmarks in the room like doors and so this will be used so that she can transition from one room to another um, and know which room she's in and how to get out of that room. So I'm going to go ahead and ask her to scan. Let me wake her up. She's getting a little bit drowsy. Okay, and uh... Scanning. So she's going to scan. Found at 269. She found Alpha. Beta found at 23. She found Beta. Target acquired. She also found the pink target over there, which I can... Fire which she uh, put the lasers on on the first try. And um, now I'll ask her to look over towards me. Look in direction 90. And uh, at this point, um, she can determine where she is. Um, and so I'm going to hit a button on my remote that will go ahead and have her tell me where she thinks she is. I am in your office at map coordinates X67 and Y73. So she uh, calculated 67 and 73, and uh, we'll, we'll check her in a minute to see how accurate that is. And I'm also going to ask her where the door fire. is. Oh, I accidentally hit the fire button. <laughs> the door is at heading 231. And so alpha is basically at 270, and so 231 is basically right at that door. And so if we uh, will now check her for accuracy. Um, so the coordinate system can be anything in any room. So she is within, she's right on the money on the X coordinate. And I would say she's pretty darn close. I need someone to hold the uh, ruler on the Y coordinate as well. And so she said 73, so she was uh, about 6 inches off, um, yeah, maybe 6 inches off on the Y coordinate. Um, so I'd say uh, that makes it pretty practical as long as I can have enough uh, visual landmarks in a room that she can recognize. Um, and it works out really well with having two. Uh, with three or more, she needs to average those, and it should get more accurate. And also, because she knows the size and orientation of each landmark, she should be able to calculate a position even from a single landmark uh, fairly well. So that's all. Hope you enjoyed it.